it's your girl alexis nicole and i am back i know it's been so long but i just recently had my baby and i'm finally feeling like myself it was a long journey and but my baby is truly like my blessing she's my entire world so <laughs> now that i'm a mother i feel like a whole nother person so actually i am dedicating this new series i'm starting which is called minding her business to my baby girl um you know i believe in being the best version of yourself and i'm on a journey to be the best version of myself and i feel like a lot of other people on youtube or even in around me or around the world wants the same thing especially in times today the things that we're seeing is just crazy <laughs> so i'm starting a new series called minding her business i'm gonna be posting videos about success wealth investing debt um your mindset and things like that things that will help you get to where you want to be help you make some more money put some more money in your pocket pay off debt investing things like that so this is going to be a very beautiful series over the next summer. So I'm really excited. And I, if you guys are interested in that, please hit the like and subscribe button. If you have any questions, you feel free to comment. I'm going to be basically giving you some side hustle ideas of 2022 that you can actually start today with little to no money. I basically put these eight ideas or nine ideas into a list of easy to hard easy by meaning it's easy to get into it's no cost starts and you'll make low to semi you know low income uh <clears throat> hard meaning it's hard to do it's a lot of knowledge you're gonna need you're gonna need to learn and it's gonna cost some money or little money to put in and it's going to reward you and numerous of ways there is no limit to how much money you can make off these ideas um if you're serious about it i you know i believe that any of you are capable of doing whatever you dream of so anyways i'm gonna go ahead and start with the first one so the first one i'm going to start with is delivery apps um y'all these apps are seriously some really good side m money um, like DoorDash, I did DoorDash once before and it was good side money. There's Uber Eats, there's Uber, Uber, you know, you're driving around people. There's also one called Amazon Flex where you're actually delivering for Amazon and you can use your own car. And the basic, basically the way they have it set up is like, there's different like shifts. So, and then this, how much you get paid is already set. So let's say you work a four hour shift and you'll make a hundred dollars. So after that four hour shift, you will you receive your hundred dollars. So that's basically $25 an hour you're making just by delivering in your own car and things like that. So look into some delivery apps. You can deliver groceries with Instacart. There's a lot of ways you can make some extra cash if you have a car and if you live in a big city, it's easy to make some extra cash. The next one is becoming a waitress or a waiter. Um, this one is not a at-home job. It is an actual job job, but it's a really easy way to make some extra income and you can even make a full-time job off of being a waitress or a waiter. Um, I know I, I'm making some really good money. Last summer I was a waitress and I was taking home like $800 a shift, but I was working at a certain place in a certain area with certain clients help. So it was a really, really fun, cool job. And I was just serving food and drinks and making some really good money based off the policies they had at that restaurant. Um, so that's another good one that's easy to start, no money down, and you bring in some moolah. So starting with the medium, medium category is YouTube channel. I say everyone should have a YouTube channel because YouTube is seriously a fun safe environment where you can create your own type of own content and make money off of your content it's really fun even i mean you know, it's a little hard in the beginning because you have to find your way you have to find an audience but once you do find like your way through youtube you can really start building an audience building a family and making money off of youtube as well 
So YouTube is a great side business and full-time business as well, but it does take a little bit of commitment and knowledge. And then another one is Instagram Reels. So Instagram just started a Reels program. It's called Bonus or Instagram Reels Bonus, something like that. And you can actually make money off your Reels on Instagram, which is super dope. I made over a thousand dollars off of Instagram. One of my videos on Instagram had went vir viral. I think I made like, I think I had got like five million views, and that's when they had offered me the um, the Reels program, and. I was like, whoa, this is dope. <laughs> Making money off Instagram, cool. And it's, some it's a really good side money. You post a video and you can make, you're making money off all the views that you are receiving. So let's check that out. Uh, <clears throat> also, to get into Instagram Reels, you have to be offered that. So if you're, on, if you're on Instagram a lot and you like to post photos, start making Reels, start, you know, uh, you know accumulating views. So Instagram can see that you're, you know, you're making content and they'll probably offer that to you depending on how many views you receive on your uh, content. I don't think it has to be a million. I think it just has to be consistent and a good number of views for you to um, receive that program. Another one is selling digital products on, Et on Etsy. So to be honest, y'all, I really believe that selling digital products on Etsy is a good idea. So great idea honestly because you don't have to hold the inventory at home you can create a product you can pay somebody to create a product like um a planner a business a business planner a social media kit um any type of digital product you can create and you can put it on your store people will buy it for how much money you um however much and you don't have to keep putting money into that business. It'll kind of be like, it would come like passive income, basically. So that is a really good idea. Look into it, think about it. But selling digital products on Etsy is something that I'm about to get into. Okay, the next one is becoming a notary public or signing agent. And a lot of my subscribers are already that, or you guys are thinking about becoming a notary public. It is a great side business and it also can become a full-time business that can you know support you pay the bills all the all those things but it does take some commitment it takes some money down and it takes um some knowledge as well you have to pay for classes you have to take a test on in some states you have to learn the laws learn how it works and how the signing works but when i was pregnant i was just literally doing general notary work and I was making some really good side money and it took me like two minutes. It was only like one or two signatures. It was easy, easy peasy. And it was some good side money. So look into that, watch my other videos so y'all can see on how to become a general notary public and a signing agent. Okay, another good one is making customized shirts. My mom, she is really good at making customized shirts and people ask her all the time if she can make them a shirt and um they pay for it and basically let's say like there's a family reunion someone's having and they need you know customized shirts they come to her tell her what they want and she makes it and she makes a little money it can also, it can also be a really fun side hustle as well making t-shirts i think it's pretty cool people love t-shirts as you can see like so look into that it will take some money to buy the things that you need but i feel like it can become a really big business if you depending on how well you make your t-shirts how good you advertise and market and how good are you are branding and things like that so i will look into that next is drop shipping so e-commerce is something else boy but if you master the art of e-commerce you can make a lot of money and drop shipping is one way people are making money with shopify shopify has apps on on the website where you that you could download and basically you can put these products that they have on your website and sell them and when you make a sale you receive the money but you don't have to deal with the product the packaging the shipping the warehouse does that for you now there's a lot of other things you have to know with drop shipping like you know i would say buy the product first to see how well the product is and how fast the shipping comes and how well the product is um, packaged and things like that but if you do do it successfully you can make a lot of money off drop shipping last but not least 
real estate wholesaling. So I was looking into this for a while and I thought it was pretty cool. It takes no money down. You just have to know a couple things with real estate. So basically they call it driving for dollars. You drive around your city and you find a house or a property that has not been taken care of. Let's say the grass is really high or, um, you know, it just looks like it's been, been abandoned and, you know, make a list of the houses that you see and you call the landlords or owners of the property and you tell them that you want to buy their property. Then they say, okay, you bet. Let's, you know, I'm going to sell my property to you. You find an investor to invest into that property. And if the investor likes it and the buyer or the seller wants to sell, then you will make a percentage of that um, that investment or that property. So I know some people who make like $5,000, $6,000 off a of property and they had to put no money down. They just did some thinking, a lot of hard work, and they stuck to it and they were very consistent as well. So that's something that, you know, if you're interested in and for you ever wanted to get into real estate, that's some, that's one way you can definitely go. People are doing it, doing it successfully. So I will look into that and, you know, see where it can take you. Okay, y'all. So that's all of the um, side hustles I have for today. I will be back with a part two to give you guys more ideas on how to make side money or some really good money too. Um, but yes, y'all, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here. Thank y'all so much for watching. I'm praying for abundance and happiness for all of you who watch to the end and everybody who clicked the video, everyone. <laughs> and I'll be back with another video soon. Stay tuned for another video in the series Minding Her Business. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye.